Happy Wednesday. We are so excited to be here with you guys on this beautiful, beautiful Wednesday. Actually, it's a little overcast here, but we're really excited to be here anyway to be able to share some amazing DIY inspiration with you guys because guess what? These projects are just killing it. We are so excited to walk you guys through this amazing, amazing project. And I am super excited to be hanging out with you guys on today's live stream. So as you're tuning in, share with us where you're visiting from. Let us know what you've got going on in your neck of the woods, um, what projects you've got going on. And we are really excited for this amazing project. This one right here is going to be an amazing one to make if you are looking for doing something with your knife blade. Um, as you guys know, knife blade is not always great to feature on live stream, but we have the knife blade version and we have the version that you're going to be able to do with your Cricut Explorer. We've been giving our Cricut Explorer so much love here, guys, and we're so excited. So considering we've had so many friends that do not have our membership because they thought, Tanner, I could not enjoy the membership with a Cricut Explorer Air 2 or Cricut Explorer. That is not the case, guys. So we wanted to just um, nip that in the bud. And we're so excited for the next three days. We have a flash sale for you guys to take advantage of our membership. So if you want to save $30, use the coupon code FLASH30. That is F-L-A-S-H-30 to be able to save $30 on your year membership. We are so excited. If you guys need to upgrade, if you guys need to grab a membership, go ahead and grab that. And especially if you are someone that has a Cricut Explorer Air 2, you're going to want to grab the membership because all the resources you're able to enjoy as well. So we're super excited about that. Um, and today we're actually cutting it on craft board. So you can cut it with white craft board, black craft board, um, craft colored craft board, whatever you want. Um, this is from Cricut. It's a really thick like chipboard material, um, but it's gonna be really good to build this project. We are using our ATG. We've got the Lynn Lily hot glue gun. We've got our acrylic paint. We've got a bottle of water for me as I am getting um, very tired, but um, it is gonna be a lot, a lot of food, uh, fun. I almost said food. <laughs> you guys know where I'm thinking about. Uh, Maria, I hope you feel better. We're so excited you're able to see the live and I'm so sorry you have the flu. Two drops of Thieves Essential Oils under your tongue and that is just gonna oh, fix oh, you right here we up. go. Y'all, I love my Thieves. That has been, I, I haven't got the flu yet this season. All I'm saying, I felt it coming on. I took, I do two drops under my tongue every single day and I'm not sick. So that's, but you know, that you've got a point there, I guess. I mean, uh, you guys know how terrible my immune system is. I don't know who believes in the essential oils or not. Courtney was not believing me until she said, Tanner, I have an acne breakout. I said, here's some tea tree oil. And she used it in the next morning. Gone. Or very significantly better. I don't know exactly. Um, but she's like, wow, this is so cool. Um, so anyway, it is a lot, a lot of fun. So yay, we love it. We got people supporting yeah, the thieves. Amen. Amen. Um, so we're so, so excited about that. Um, but it's a lot, a lot of fun. So happy, happy Wednesday, everyone. Wow, what what great thieves supporters we got out here. Y'all, we are gonna be so excited. Um so Renee says, now this is a great conversation real quick before we make the project. I don't believe in essential oils work. I think it's more of a mind trick in all honesty. Okay, here's the deal. Tanner's got a great, I, he's, got a, he's got a good little point I about honestly this. do not care either way. They smell good. <laughs> they're great. I think they honestly like can help. But even if, let's say they don't, the placebo effect is real, y'all. Mm. I think they're great. Mm. As long as I feel better and I feel good, Works for me. Um, the Raven oil is literally like Vicks Vapo Rub. I love it. Mm -hmm. <sighs> I will. I will use it to make my house smell good, like oils. Now, and stuff. Rachel, you gave me a testimony about what you did with essential oils. What? What did I do with essential oils? Clean something. I don't know. Huh? Well, I clean with. No, 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 no. You didn't clean with it. Something you used. Did you use? You used tea tree oil. Oh yeah, but see, okay, this piercings? is dumb. That's before I even knew that tea tree oil was an was an essential oil. Like before this got popular, I bought it like. Like five or six years ago, Rachel, when I got my essential piercings. oils have been used for years. Plant-based like, medicine, but like I didn't know. I was like, let me get this at Walmart. Okay. So I've just been using that. 
And but it helps my helps. piercings. It dries them up, and you know, if one of them's wow. irritating me. So I guess I use one. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. But I love okay. things. Anyway. Becca's a big breathe again girl. I don't really know if I'd start rolling them on myself, you know. Well, now the ones that'll help you breathe better, I would, and I'll clean with thieves and stuff. Yeah, thieves is great. Yeah, it's crazy. <sighs> Courtney, I think I'm with Tanner though. It, whether it works or not, whatever. I'm not here to debate that. Whatever, I'm a doctor. you know. I'm not, there's studies that will say it does, and if they want to go with it, great. Good. But yeah, Becca and Courtney both want thieves to smell a little different, which yeah. it's okay. Um, Deborah says they do work better than medical drugs. Um, so it's going to be a lot of fun. Isabel, we do need to create an Amazon storefront with all our recommendations. I will make someone work on that right now. I'm right this second. Right, not right now. I, I'm after, on it. <laughs> after we get done, I'm going to assign that to someone because I agree. We do need to do that. Um, ooh, to put sweet oil in my ear if I had an earache. The doctor, I don't know. Can you tell us what s sweet oil is? Megan is loves stress oil? away. Yes, um, my mom. My mom's mm -hmm. a big oil gal. Okay, <laughs> so sorry. We just had to. We had to have some type of chat. But <laughs> if you guys are just tuning in, we're making this adorable project today. We have a great, great promotion going on today. If you use the coupon code FLASH30, you're going to be able to get your membership. You're going to be able to get your summit ticket. Guys, summit is coming up so quick, and we want you guys to join us for March 21st and 22nd. Um, that is going to be an amazing weekend of a lot of creating, a lot of inspiration, and a lot of motivation to use our die cutting machines. There's 10 classes that weekend, so five on Saturday, five on Sunday, and it's a lot, a lot of fun. So please get your ticket now. Use the coupon code FLASH30 so you can save on that. Or we are actually featuring um, a technique from our amazing Cricut Pro 2 course. Now, if you guys have not taken Pro 2, definitely stepped it up quite a few steps from Pro 1 um, with techniques. And in there, we teach you guys how to do offset. So offset is something you cannot do in Cricut, unfortunately. Um, but it's something that we do teach in the class so that you guys are able to take full advantage of. Um, and it's a really helpful thing. So we'll dive more into what offset is, why you need offset and things like that, um, here in a little bit. But I do want to point that out. If you need pro two, I highly recommend you take advantage of that coupon code, um, flash 30 to sign up for it because it's a work at your own pace program. Um, and there's 20 advanced projects. So you get a 150 page ebook and the live additional training is coming very soon for the members of Pro 2. So stay tuned for that if you are signed up and we're so, so excited. And Miss Becca, this actually is a question for you. Okay. Becca is the one who created this project first and she, uh, Miss Maria wants to know, how long did it take to cut this out when we used With the knife chipboard? Blade. With Cricut chipboard. Um, Do you remember Becca? How long it took? No, I feel like I, I hit it cut and went to the store. Was it like 45 minutes? It, yeah, so a cut like this will average you 45 minutes to an hour and 20. Yeah. It depends right there. This right here, we yeah. used Cricut chipboard. Um, you know, what we do with our knife blade is we sit it and forget it. But what I do like to recommend is to take your um, air, your canned <laughs> air, and have that ready to go in case something happens and you're on the other craft table, other side of your table working on something. You can just kind of check in on it every 10, 15 minutes. Yeah. So yeah. that is what I would recommend for the knife blade. We have great video trainings on the knife blade. In Pro 2, we have it on the YouTube channel for a few different ones. Um, so definitely take advantage of that. But seriously, guys, if you're on the fence about membership, today is the best day to do it um, so that you can grab your membership today and get access to over 2,000 cut files, 300 plus fonts for our yearly members, our commercial license, and so much more. We are so excited for you guys. And Tanner, so, Miss Esther just said, just had my first one, one year anniversary with Makers and Learn. Year two, here we go. We love it. Congratulations, <laughs> Esther. Woohoo! We love it. Love it. Hey, Miss Connie, how are you, dear? Um, what? Wish I could ship my husband off the for the weekend so I could do the summit. Lisa, you can do the summit because you get your ticket now. You have lifetime access to that programming for ever um so you can take these courses at your own pace and the best part is there's 10 classes so when you take that cost of the summit ticket divided across 10 classes it's not very much at all instead of having to buy each one of these programs um at like 80 to 90 dollars yeah. a program um this is such a better deal and that's why we have the summit so yeah. it's a lot of fun. and also if you're busy the weekend of the summit no worries because just like tanner said you do get those classes you won't be missing out on anything exactly. and tanner miss Shar said if we haven't taken pro one do you recommend pro two i honestly 
think Pro 2 is great and I would take it first for sure. Um, just because it's the latest program, you've seen a lot of your fellow peers in the Facebook group making those projects. And if you want to make those advanced level projects, those are projects that you can't just find a tutorial for on Pinterest. So leveling up with your die cutting machine means saying yes to, you know, things like Pro 2. So I highly recommend it. There's a lot of diversity in that um, and you're going to really love, love, love that. So yay. Oh my gosh. Welcome back. Haven't been here. Um, haven't a long time. Haven't been here. Hello. We're so excited you're back um, and we're really, really pumped up. So we've got to jump into today's project because there is a lot to get through and untraditionally, we've got stuff to do in design space right out of the bat. Yeah. Step one yeah. in design space. So let's go ahead and take a look. Do, do, do. Getting my keyboard ready. Okay, so here we guys um, are. You guys can see you have this amazing military photo frame that we are so excited. It's two layers. And since we're using the Cricut Explore today, we are going to cut this right here um, twice. So this background, that's actually the frame. We're gonna cut this two different times using craft board um, or yeah, craft board. This is craft board white from Cricut. We'll be able to share with you guys all of the um, information, but all you wanna do, um, you want to check out the um, shop Cricut link down below and search chipboard and you'll be able to pick that up. That is an affiliate link and we would really, really appreciate your um, you know support with those links down below. So anyway, we're gonna cut that twice, which is great. But what I wanna share with you guys is how we built this and how you can build this and different things like that. So first things first, you have your cut file, which is the one to the left. So this is what it's gonna end up being. It's gonna end up being like two different files um, that we're gonna cut, which is great. And what we're really excited about is the Freedom Isn't Free file is a perfect, perfect t-shirt, okay? So what you'd wanna do for this project is just turn off or hide the layer that says Freedom Isn't Free. So you hide that and now you have your awesome um, little project right here. Now, what you're gonna to want to do is after you turn that off, you're gonna to want to create um, and upload the offset version of this. So this is the offset version that we have at Makers Gonna Learn as well, so you can upload it um, and do this. But you may be saying, Tanner, I wanna know exactly how I will be able to do this with any cut file that I want, no matter which one um, that you ever create, um, you know, you wanna be able to do offset too. Well, we have that for you guys in our Cricut Pro 2 course. This is one of the 20 projects we teach, and this is something you're gonna be able to replicate multiple, multiple times with different projects, images, and different things like that. In Pro 1, we taught you guys how to offset text, which is awesome, but it's even better to be able to offset every single image that we've ever wanted. Um, so this is really a big deal, and it's gonna be a lot, a lot of fun. So anyway, what we're going to do, um, you know, is just upload it and now you're good to go. But let's say you do not have offset, you don't want to offset or anything like that. What can you do? So what I'm going to share with you guys is how to, you can kind of do like an offset shadow or something, but it's not going to be the same. Yeah, we. I think the biggest recommendation if you don't want to do offset or you, don't, you haven't learned and you haven't gotten that Pro 2 course is to only do this with paper if you're not right. able to offset or vinyl. it with the, um, well, we're doing it with vinyl as well, like over right, top of right. it. But as far as cutting it goes, it's a lot harder for the Cricut knife blade to cut uh, in between those little areas, as you can see, uh, where the offset kind of made it a lot easier for right. that to cut. So really, you know, to yeah, offset's thing. amazing. Yeah. And if you are in Pro 2, please take that training because you're going to love how easy it is. Um, and it's a lot, a lot of fun. So you definitely need it. Cricut, unfortunately, does not have it. And we're terribly sorry about that. But what we love is that we share with you guys exactly how to do it for free. Because um, you could buy other softwares or machines and things. But we want to be able to use it with our Cricut. So and that's a lot of fun. And I don't want to give a lot away. But in the next couple of weeks, we do have a great... Um, 
some really good cuff I was launching that have some like pre-made offsets mm -hmm. that you guys get mm -hmm. to take advantage of, which is going to be really fun for you guys. Yes, so it's going to be a lot of fun. And offsets give you, you know, a lot better quality. You're able to do a little bit more professional looks and things like that. But let's say for some reason you, you can't and you want to know what's the, be <laughs> the next best thing um, to cut with chipboard. So let's go ahead and duplicate this right here. And then all you're going to want to do is kind of change this to a different color. Um, so we're going to just be able to change the color right here and I'm going to change it to the start gray and then we're going to click send to back. And then all you're going to want to do is kind of see and unlock it and you're going to kind of scale it up so you can kind of play around with it. But as you're going to see, there's not anything to make it perfect. Like it's honestly just going to make it the same size um, and it's very confusing to be able to design something, you know, quite correct. So, um, you know, that can be an issue and this is totally different than offset. You're not going to be able to serve exactly the same purpose as you would if you, um, you know, did that. So you're going to run into issues like this. This is what you need to learn offset. And this is really just to kind of share with you guys the example of why offset is so important. You just can't, you know, put a background on here. I think that's a big misconception um, on the two. So as you guys can see, there's truly, truly, truly um, a struggle that takes place when you're trying to, you know, just put a background on it, make it bigger. <laughs> For this project, that is not gonna happen. Now, if this was just a circle, you could easily do that. If this was a rectangle, you could easily do that. But with this one, you are not able to do that, unfortunately. So I just like to share and demonstrate that. That's so important why you'll need to take Pro 2 um, to learn how to offset and you know, it's just a lot of fun. So that's in that training course. And then look, this right here, you know, you can make this project right away um, with our cut files, but to do it with your own images and things, definitely take the, take the program. So yay, we're so excited. Looks like we have a big auditor community. Woohoo, a lot of home health charts. I love it, how fun. Um, so we're really, really excited. So this is the size. We decided to make ours to be seven inches wide by eight and a quarter inches um, tall. So that is going to be so much fun. And yeah, let us know in the comments, guys, who you're going to make this project for. This would be so nice to you know give us a gift and just have a lot of you know fun with. So this is going to be really, really good. So now after you've done that, I'm going to quickly just duplicate this layer since we are cutting it twice. Um, you could do project copies, but here's the thing. It would give us two of our vinyl cutouts, but we do not um, want to do that. So just like that, we have all three of the layers we want to cut. We click make it and you guys can see we're going to cut that in vinyl. And then we're going to have two mats cut with our awesome offset. Um, so it is going to be a lot, a lot of fun. So yay, we're super excited. Miss Sharon says, I'm trying to join, but I'm getting a message. The website is unsafe and it won't let me proceed. Miss Sharon, if you would love to do me the biggest favor ever, I would love if you could take a photo of that, take a photo from your phone to uh, the screen, or if you know how to take a screenshot on your computer, that would honestly be the biggest lifesaver ever. Um, and then email it to us, hi at makersgonnalearn.com. That would be so amazing so that we can um, handle that um, because we do not, as you know, our website is very safe um, and we want to fix any errors if they're there. Yeah, so, we want to get you into that membership, yes, girl. Yes, 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 yes. And while we set up the layers. Hang on, um, I got it, I got it. You need a mat, right? I do need I, a mat. I snapped mine and forgot <laughs> to get you a new one, sorry. No worries, Rach, no worries. Thank you, dear. Um, so we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna start by cutting out one of these mats so we are going to do it miss karen says saw rachel's video yesterday on the 15 tips loved it really good tips guys yes rachel had so many amazing tips to share um and it was such a great video thank you um so we're going to be able to select craft board and then we're going to be able to prepare it and load it in and this will be a project where i do not recommend fast mode just because we're cutting such thicker material okay so this mat right here is not sticky but the top sticky it might just be your hands again tanner it's, it's a relatively fresh it. mat you want me to get you a brand new one okay okay I, I don't mean to be picky it's just 
Maybe it's my hands. They're You're not, so picky. They're not sweaty today. <laughs> sometimes I touch them and I'm like, how is Isn't this Isn't that gonna, crazy? It's weird. It's so weird. Yeah. Sometimes your mat's sticky when you don't think so. So here we guys go. We have the Cricut craft board. And for the friends that have, um, you know, really, really great, um, you know, different materials and having a Cricut Explorer, definitely get this. And even if you have a maker, get this material. It's so good to use. We it's use so it a easy. Lot. We love it. So this is just craft board white. There's a pack that I prefer for the variety, especially when getting started, that has white, craft, and black. Amazing. We, we've brought that probably more, but what's the one we use the most? Because we can do things like we are today, which we're going to paint it up and have a lot of fun with it. And Miss Tammy, you do not need to use a strong grip mat with this unless your strong grip <laughs> mat, bless you Tanner, Thank you, dear. is very, very, very unsticky. <laughs> bless you. Thank you, dear. Woo. But uh, a standard grip mat should do just fine or even a, a new light grip mat, something like that. Mm -hmm. I just ordered mats because we were fresh out of fresh <laughs> mats, but... I hope this one works today. Yep, so we're just gonna load that in and then we're gonna be able to cut it. It's gonna be really easy um, to just go through and then press the flashing Cricut button and we're gonna let that just cut through. And then we'll, after that first one cuts, we'll be able to start painting it and it's gonna be a lot, a lot of fun. So um, the drop shadow saves us a lot of time and a lot of problems. So it is gonna be a lot, a lot of fun. So, and yay. guys, you do not need the maker for this project. As you can see right we're now- We're using a Cricut Explorer. The Explorer is cutting. We we're did, making two versions. Yeah. So we have made the one with Cricut chipboard, but Tanner, which she's thick. She she thick. I mean, you know? guys, like yeah. the maker. You pay more for the maker. It's a lot, to, a little more time consuming for the maker, but you get the perks of the maker. Yeah, yeah. And Tanner wanted to make sure that anyone could make this project. So exactly. yeah, we did it with craft for today. Yes. Mm -mm -mm. So you guys are gonna love this. It's gonna be a lot of fun. It's just cutting away. Now with this material, let's go cut through like two times. So we're at 75% and it's just doing that second cut through. Um, it cuts really quick because of the offset. So if you guys, again, I wanna you know not stress it too much, but we do have the flash sale using the coupon code FLASH30. So if you need to take advantage of Cricut Pro 2, um, you get to learn how to make your own offsets there and completely free, so super cool. We don't make you, there's no additional software we recommend. It's a free software. So now you're going to be able to peel this up and craft work really th like thick, thick material. So you can just take it and look, you can just pop that up and it's so easy. So this is layer one and then you can go ahead and cut out layer two, just like so. Um, we'll just pop it in. And then after that, we'll cut our vinyl. And the best part is we're gonna be able to go ahead and start painting. So we're gonna take this one and we're just gonna be able to paint it up. So I'm gonna use kind of like the scrap paper to put down if we need it. And then what I'm going to do now is zoom in. Hello. Um, one thing I do wanna to touch on while, before we paint this, if you're working with craft board um, and really good acrylic paint, you usually do not need any sealers or anything like that. Um, but what you want to do if you're using craft board, or excuse me, chipboard. So this is the Cricut chipboard. This is the back of ours. So here's the front. You can see it up close and personal. It's really thick. It's really, really nice. But what you're gonna wanna do if you're using the chipboard, you need to order you some Minwax polyurethane and clear gloss spray um, or satin, satin's a great finish. Give it two or three coats because if not, your acrylic paint is going to seep into this wood and it's gonna make you cause like four different like layers. Um, so it's a lot, a lot of work. So please, please, please spray this, please spray this and it'll save you a lot. So any sealer, Mod Podge, anything like that will be great. Now, when it comes to the craft board that we're using, this is a, you know, still a board, like you can hear it. Listen to that. So that's what that kind of the material is like, that's the thickness, like it's thicker than 110 pound cardstock, but you know, it's not near as thick as chipboard. So I use the fine point blade in my Cricut Explorer Air 2. Um, the Air 2 does offer fast mode, unlike some of the other machines um, in the Explorer lineup that does not. 
Tanner I'm, loves fast mode. I love fast mode. <clears throat> we just didn't use it for today's project. Now, before we go ahead and you know finish this project up, this is an awesome roll. Look at this industrial roll. I feel so professional. Um, Do you, have, Tanner? Yes, yes. <laughs> uh, we have the 651 vinyl. I'm just gonna cut us off a piece right here, just enough for to cut this project. And I assume this is enough. I totally just guessed. Yeah, mm -hmm. it should be. You sure. need about three and a half inches, about six yeah. inches. Oh, perfect. Um, so you're just gonna wanna take this back and you know, you can get this when it's on sale. It's gonna be great. So here we go. Just like so. And then sometimes you wanna be careful about these edges. You wanna make sure your vinyl's down right. Um, so we're just go move this like that and it's gonna be smooth sailing and don't forget guys to rechange your yes, material settings yes 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 Tanner, i'm absolutely blind i cannot see the regular vinyl setting um let's just choose premium vinyl um i think they may have let's just... hope it doesn't cut too deep on i don't that. think so we'll do well, deep, where the deep crap off. is the regular vinyl setting yeah um not sure who knows? They may have changed regular uh, vinyl to premium? the premium vinyl oh. setting. Who knows? But we're going <laughs> to cut that out. And now while that is cutting, guys, what we're going to do is work on painting um, these right here. So you're going to paint two of these, um, the opposite side. So if you want it finished, or you can only paint one and then just, you know, glue it together. So either yeah. way you want to go with today's project, it'll be really good. Yeah. So, so. Like, also just be mindful, just like Tanner said, about which... Uh, time well like which way you paint it because they do yes. it's going to sandwich together so it needs to mirror each other so you can't paint both fronts because then it won't you know it won't look right yeah no it's a lot of fun so no matter what machine you have guys you're going to be able to make a, a version of this project oh it's yeah gonna be great now today we're using a makeup sponge feel free to pull out your foam brush feel free to put it pull out your regular paintbrush whatever you prefer we like this because it does not leave any um like paint uh, streaks or anything like that so it's gonna be really good so you can just see right here um this is like gonna be a really nice light coat but it will require a second coat so just be careful about that sealing it does help a lot yeah it helps it just like when you guys seal chipboard like we tell you all the time it definitely helps right and one thing you want to be careful about when you do this um is that you're gonna see the craft board is going to kind of um want to curl up how to get it not to curl up is to have your heat gun so the heat gun will actually counteract that which is great um so you guys can kind of see it's really easy to just go through and again you can paint this you could use um darker colored you know chipboard or anything like that you could use spray paint you could do a lot of different things you could mist this with some really cool spray that's cool uh, you someone do asked inks. someone asked if they could do yeah tanner it was i think it was alcohol inks miss claire said can you use alcohol inks instead of paint you absolutely yes could. get that the mixed really media cool. out in you you could leave it as like a camo you could do it your own camo pattern you could <gasps> do your own camo pattern. that would be, that would be cool. really neat the, and the paint the paint sponge would do really well mm -hmm. um, for this so either way you want to go with it as you guys can see, you're going to do this for, you know, one coat. And then I'm going to kind of share with you guys what it'll look like after that. Um, we have another one we can, can share. But first, we're going to take a little a moment of silence. Uh, a moment of silence. Um, a moment. And we're going to weed this out for our project. So we're just going to take our craft knife. We're going to cut this here. So we'll have another little piece for the scrap bin and guys just because we've had several uh questions about it and i've answered them typing i'll answer it verbally as well yes, let us we're know. using the amazing sure bonder lynn lily oh my glue gosh y'all everyone needs to go order it right now love 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 lynn lily by sure bonder this is a mini hot glue gun that has a precision tip and it's so good. So we have three of these in the studio and I think we just opened this one today, right? Yeah, um, yeah, so it's I, brand spanking new. I gotta upgrade, gotta upgrade today. Um, and it's just because we have so many, we just funnel them around. So now I'm just going to weed out this right here. Um, but seriously, Lynn is a great friend of mine. If you guys have not um, got her glue gun, you need it. So look at that right here, you're able to go through and now we're able to weed out these different pieces Ta -ta. how awesome yay 
Do, 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 do. So I'm just weeding this out. And then after this, we are gonna be able to go through and paint another coat onto our project. And then we'll have one that is um, good to go. So just like so, um, you know, we have this weeded and we'll go ahead. Today we're gonna feature the paper transfer tape because um, it's really, really awesome. Well, and it we need it to you be a little bit it. more uh, mild yes. because we're putting this on paper, which I mean, if you're putting on craft board or something like that, that's totally fine too, you know? Yeah. Do what you want, but with us using, um, I meant chipboard, not craft board. Oh, with us okay. using craft board, it needs to be a lot uh, less sticky. Yeah, you do not want to use regular, uh, like, like, regular like Cricut transfer tape or anything like that. For today's project, you need, you need um, to use something like this. And if you don't have this and you're like, I wanna make this project today, use painter's tape, use masking tape. Yeah. Um, or, believe it or not, I'm about to say this, a cut file is pretty easy. You don't even need transfer tape. That's you true. You can transfer this yourself. You could make it like a sticker. This yeah. this is a good example of one that would be okay yes. doing that. Yes, yes, yes. And Tanner, Miss Shar said, y'all need Char. an affiliate link for that glue gun. <laughs> y'all, I will be real we with you. Do. I did get gifted this beautiful um, glue gun, but I'm not an affiliate for sure, Bonder. I'm, I don't get anything besides street cred with uh, our my, my good friend. Um, Lynn and she's just so sweet so we just help each other out and you know we just support everyone um so she is amazing and I think you'll really enjoy your the glue gun that's why that's why I share anything it's not about it's not about the affiliate money so anyway we're gonna set that to the side and then after everything is painted you'll see um by coat two this is really awesome and then what we're gonna do for this one we thought we wanted to make this look as professional as possible so we're gonna take it we're gonna glue it just like this so that you guys can see we'll have a professional front look and we'll have a professional back look. So no matter which side you're looking at, um, it's very professional. So you're Ooh. gonna take one side, yes dear. Tanner, the hey. glue gun is sold out. What? Oh my God. No I did not mean to cut way. you off, but this is, this is big. Until April, they weren't gonna be Stop it. Oh my God. Stop it, stop it, no. We must have them. No, I'm, I'm, what? I'm texting Lynn. Oh, my Tanner's texting Your her. <laughs> glue gun is sold out? Until, uh, Until April? Until April? Is that what we heard? Yeah. Stop. Stop. Y'all, I'm literally. Tanner. How can we, how, we need, Makers and Learning needs the first. I'm we glad need we to reserve them up. Yeah, I'm glad we got, we literally just asked for a few more just because there's so many of us um, and we are obsessed. We just needed more. Um, wow. There, I've not seen a hot glue gun. That's Talk about luck. With the colors. And what we're doing now is we're gluing them together yeah. with the advanced tape glotter. Again, y'all, you need this one right here. It is so good. Um, it's the most affordable, economical way to draw adhesive. Yep. And notice I'm doing an excessive amount. It's yeah. very intentional. And watch how Tanner's doing it so close to the edge, on the mm -hmm. edges. That's really going to take it from, um, you know, kind of beginner to yep. a little bit more professional because you don't want those ends to fan out. You really want no. them to set well with each other. Sealed. So him putting all that on the very edges is really going to make a difference. Yep. We're just going to go all over here. Um, and there's a technique to mastering it. So if you've bought this and you're like, Tanner, why is it not working for me? Um, I think, and Rachel can probably can attest to this, it's like, there's a technique, and you have to learn the technique. So, um, highly recommend learning that technique and taking your time with it. Um, and then you just want to position this down, just like so. Take your time. This is a process. Yeah, it is. You know? It this is, is a process. Is. But watch how Tanner's also just letting a couple of the first inches down. He's not mm -hmm. placing the whole thing down. Mm -hmm. And Miss Tasha, it's sold out. We do not have the link to that glue gun. You guys can Google it, search it. It's the Sherbonder Lynn Lily hot glue gun. Yep, 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 yep. We love, love, love the hot glue gun. Um, so you're going to love it as well. And then look guys, we, we have this right here. That looks great. It's adorable. Um, we're really excited for it. So. This is great. And then what we're gonna do now is we're gonna be able to take this um, and we're gonna flip it around. And we're just gonna peel back 
this with its transfer tape. Look at how good everything's adhering with this masking tape transfer tape. How awesome. And then guys, if you realize this is a great time, just a little craft tip. If you realize, oh my gosh, Tanner, I forgot to weed out a piece. This is when you can save your mistake. Look at what I forgot to weed out right here. Look, we're gonna do a technique called reverse weeding. You guys just got to witness me reverse weeding. Reverse weeding is when you have your project and it's on. Oh, I've got another piece to reverse weed. This is a great training. If you are listening to this mindlessly, please stop what you're doing and what you're gonna to want to do is kinda of, you know, come back and follow along. So you have your project on transfer tape. This transfer tape is called masking paper transfer tape. We get so many questions about this that we link it directly on Amazon. It's like $11, you get a huge roll. This is probably halfway used to be honest. Um, it's, you get I think six inches by a hundred feet. A hundred feet. Six inches is our favorite size because it's perfect for anything. But a hundred feet for eleven dollars, very affordable. Um, but anyway, if you ever want and have a complicated project, it's easier to reverse weed. So you can just take it, um, and because the transfer tape is holding your project in place, it allows you to weed even easier. So, say with that pin pin tool. You can see here, just weed this out. Look at that. So you're able to, you know, weed really easy. Really, really easy. So let us know if you have watched our videos on reverse weeding before. If you've ever heard of reverse weeding, it's definitely an amazing, amazing technique. Um, so we love this right here. Um, so it's a lot of fun. So yes, lots of things to talk about today. And if you guys did not know, let us know if you are brand new to Maker School Learn, never have heard about us, let us know um, because we're really, really excited um, for you guys to be able to be here and to check out our amazing membership. So what we're gonna do now after we reverse weed it, what we're gonna do is we're gonna line this up and you've gotta make sure all of these little pieces are lined up. And this is probably debatably one of the harder parts of the project because you can't really see. Yeah, I guess that would be the benefit to using the other clear transfer That's tape. True. Which, don't we have a clear top of this? We do have a new clear top that I just picked up at like a over. I should have gave store. you that today to no, use. No, it's totally fine. I'm just I'm just checking it out, trying to see what's going to happen. Um, and Miss Joanne over on Facebook, we hey, do browse the comments on Facebook, but yes. there's so much going on over here on YouTube that yes. we do recommend you all to come over here and ask all of your amazing crafty questions, but we are monitoring a little bit over there as well. Yes, but YouTube is like the bread and butter for the show, so we you know, really support over on the YouTube, um, but either way you go, I think as long as you guys get to enjoy the show. That's the most important part. Absolutely. And Tanner, Miss uh, Landa says, as a newbie, I have crash courses on all your videos. Yay, we're so excited you enjoyed it. Well, if you have not decided to plunge into the membership, guys, you know, you are right if you're thinking, oh, I can find cut falls anywhere online. The membership is not just about cut falls. Do you get 1,900 amazing cut falls you can't find anywhere else? Heck yeah. Do you, you know, want to get amazing training? Do you want to have a great community? What thing you cannot find is amazing fonts. It is so hard to find amazing fonts. Um, and fonts are available in our year membership as long oh, as well as like things like our amazing Cricut printable guide. This guide is so good. Um, you know, it's a nice large printable. You're able to learn terminology. You're able to learn what blade to use. I mean, all of this is so good and you get this as an additional free membership perk um, as soon as you join. So definitely consider joining the membership today. First link down below, Rachel will have it for you in the comments. Use the coupon code FLASH30 and get your membership today. So we're so excited about that. So yay, so good. But look, we have this adorable, adorable project and here it is, but we do not stop there because we're now going to be able to use our sold out Lynn Lily hot glue gun and attach one of these alligator clips, right? Like this. Are these alligator or bulldog? I never remember. I have no idea. I, think <laughs> I say bulldog. whatever comes to my mind. Oh, I don't know about you. Okay. Bulldog clips. I didn't know alligator if alligator clips, clips were another different. thing because. Bulldog. bulldog, okay. Oh, alligators have teeth, don't yeah. they? Okay. Yeah, they're for hair bows and things. Hey, I apologize. It, it, they're all clips, Tanner. That's true. Fine. That's true. Um, amazing fonts that include a commercial license. Yes, guys. So you can, you know, use any of our artwork to make your own 
um, business and sell your own projects and things like that, which is so incredibly important for you guys that are on the journey of building your own business. So yes, check that out if you have not, um, you know, save $30 and become a member today. And look at this precision tip, y'all. Tess also said, you guys need to brag about your commercial license more. Oh, we love the commercial license. So you guys are really, you know, set up for success. And look at that Lynn Lily hot glue gun, how easy it is to use. Just like so. And I just added a little bit. I'm going to add a little bit more right back here as well. Just like so. Okay, so now you have your glue. If there's ever any strings, you can just physically pull these off after they dry um, and, you know, twist those away. So really, really easy and it's really adorable. So what you guys have got right here is this is our amazing craft board version. So you're able to use this with the craft board version. Um, it is so good. This is the material we featured from Cricut. If you haven't checked that out already, Here's the you know finished craft board version, a little thinner. And then here's the chipboard version with the knife blade. So you can definitely see the difference. Both are great options. I mean, they great both look options. amazing. Yeah. Um, you know, you're able to have a lot of fun with either. Unless you're a pro, I don't think you could tell a big difference if you weren't like feeling it and right, knowing that one, right, right. like if it was just displayed somewhere, you wouldn't know. Yeah, you know? And, the, and the best part is that a lot of these are going to be, um, you know, have a lot, a lot of fun. Um, you know, that he's going to, that we're, you're going to be able to sit up on your desk, you're going to use a little stand and, you know, the results are still going to be really great um, and have a lot, a lot of fun. So definitely check out this project either way with the um, knife blade or the Cricut Explorer, you know, lineup maker, non-maker, as you guys can see head to head, they look amazing. Um, so that is a lot, a lot of fun. So it's gonna be a lot of fun. Oh my gosh, I'm using my commercial license for the first time at a craft fair next weekend to pay for all the summits, starting with the spring summit. Woohoo! We love it, guys. You all are able to truly finance all your crafting with, um, you know, you have to make the investment for the membership and then you're able to really enjoy everything. Um, and yes, I'm so sorry. The uh, masking paper price changes very frequently. Yeah, we're not supposed to give away, we're not supposed to say prices yeah, on it's live because just because Amazon, the, yeah. it, uh, it changes prices so much. I think it's around $14 regularly, but yeah. again, it could change. We have change. no idea. That it's is... worth it really. No, I, I think we would pay like 20 bucks for the stuff. For sure, we use it so much. It's good it's stuff. so, so good. Um, but yes, I do want to share with you guys that may be on the fence about getting your membership, um, you know, what you definitely get in the membership because it is so, so important. So right here, whoopsie, um, you can go ahead and click our join page and you're going to be able to get access to over 200, now almost 300 amazing fonts um, and with 20 new fonts added every single month. I also love the comment for a female soldier, maybe glitter vinyl. Yes, I love that. Um, so good. And then um, the commercial license to make money with your machine. You cannot put a price on that. You also get access to the three different free training classes and you pay the lowest amount um, you know, for our year membership versus being monthly for an entire year. So what are the three classes you may be asking? These are them. You get to learn exactly how to use your machine. You get to break into Cricut Design Space and then you get to build a business through die cutting. So this is included in your Facebook, um, excuse me, in your membership, as well as the membership community. So a lot of people are like, Tanner, I wanna kind of see inside the membership a little bit more. So if you wanna see inside, let us know what you wanna see, um, but I'll also give you a quick breakthrough. So, um, you know, break down. So you can see your cut files right here. Um, and it's a lot, a lot of fun. So um, we have a newbie story. I made my son who is in the army, his dog, a t-shirt with my membership using the fonts y'all gave me that says my hero and daddy wear the dog tags. Oh, that's adorable. We love that. That is so sweet. But anyway, as soon as you become a member, you get access to our entire cut file library. We hold nothing back. Um, from the cut fall library, whether you go monthly, yearly, whatever you go, um, you know, you get access to all of this. So really good. We have accents, we have anniversary, 
apparel. I mean, there's so, so many. Um, so yay. And the Lynn Lily hot glue gun is sold out, unfortunately, it looks like from our friends. So, um, so yes, that's a lot of fun. But um, what you also can look at is our fonts. So you can actually look around um, at these um, without being a member, so feel free and it is so good. But also what we wanna share with you guys is our dashboard, because that's where a lot of, um, you know, some of the secret stuff is. So if you are a member and you go to your dashboard, you're gonna be able to go ahead and see the member resources, which are so good. This is where we stash the Cricut Printable Guide. We have the collection PDF, the fonts, um, and a lot of other ones like our Cricut iOS Guide. So you guys can check that out. We get a lot of questions on if we, you uh, can use your membership on iOS, on the iPad and things like that. And this is a great resource for that. Exactly. We used to use our iPad all the time. Oh my gosh, Rachel, people used to get mad at us. I know. <laughs> you can't please everybody, but you know. know. Uh, well, you can use a ton of stuff with our membership. Yeah, but look, I mean, this is just, you know, 10 pages in and we're already diving into, you know, some really great techniques. So um, you guys can check that out. This is completely free. That's probably a $50 value um and then you know one of our favorite perks is our member only facebook group and again guys the membership is um on sale today um so you can use the coupon code flash 30 and we are logged on to quartz facebook so um here you go you guys can see there's so many great things i love looking at the photos um so you guys can kind of see what people's doing we've got people already getting ready for easter that's so much fun um, you guys can see this one right here, uh, Erica. Oh my gosh, member of the day goes to Erica. Look at this, being a family means that you will love and be loved for the rest of your life. Using some of those new cut balls. Rachel, look, I Even love photographed that. Well. Photographed well. Erica is That's killing the I love the that frame. Game. Beautiful. Y'all, these are real people. We have over 5,000 fellow like-minded crafters that you guys are gonna be able to, you know, fellowship with and have fun and just so, good so we love it um and it's really great so just love all of the members um a lot of friends are making adorable projects like debbie Aww, bunny i so love that bunny butt file me too it's so cute we've got uh that one's my life. favorite stephanie is showing up they and made showing it. out i know Fair. she's showing out right now with her amazing design space files becca that's our camper camp file lock i know so cool adorable yeah that's adorable who does not need to drink their morning iced coffee in their camper with that cup? Hello. Um, so adorable. But anyway, guys, I also just want to show up and shout out um, Miss Connie has made one for herself and one of her neighbors. Um, we loved sharing this. No, I want to shout out everyone Literally. who made one of Look, these. Tammy's made one too. Knowing that that particular video didn't get finished, you all rocked <laughs> it, like really. Yeah, we gave you, you figured all it out. Yeah, there's so many different things and we have seen a lot of people. There's, yeah. there's a lot of people that was able to share theirs, so keep sharing. Um, another one, we have uh, Carrie um, sharing hers. Go to those rolled files ones, the oh. rolled flower ones. It's... Someone cut them out <gasps> so that they had a reference guide. Oh. Yes. Oh. She did, I think there's three pages of them. Yes. Oh, my gosh. Lauren. Oh my That's so I mean, neat. guys, what a community right here. It is so, so good, and we have a lot of fun. Um, and membership is awesome so if you don't have a membership check it out one thing i wanted to share with you guys is the membership levels so you can be a monthly member as little as 19.99 a month um you can be a six month member for 17.99 a month and you can be a yearly member for 15.99 a month the lowest amount notice you get the most stars but here's the catch here's the catch you pay for the yearly membership in one lump sum and you do not pay it again for another 12 months. Very typical with any membership platform or anything like that. So you pay the um, least amount and you get the most, and we never run a sale on our monthly membership. Um, so you get uh, the discount code that we've talked about today, Flash 30, on our yearly membership. So it's 191.88. You come down here, you go to coupons, you type in Flash 30, and then you apply it, and then look at it right there. You can be a yearly member as low as 161.88. Um, you make a commitment now, and then every single month you get new cut files, fonts, and so 
much more. You guys are bound to love it. Um, and just so many, so many projects. Oh my gosh, I believe Tammy is here. Tammy, congratulations for making such um, amazing projects. I believe that is your projects, my friend, that we were showcasing one of these. Um, uh, yep, Tammy, look, this is Tammy. She made this and not only did she make it, but she asked how much people would charge for it. Um, so she is amazing and you know, it is so, so good. Um, and you could, you know, definitely sell this and have a lot of fun. So we love that. And yes, 12 months of stress-free crafting with a yearly membership. Amen. Woohoo. You guys are amazing. But anyway, that is just my spiel. Now I do want to say if you have not got your spring summit ticket, March 21st, 22nd, use this coupon code, take full advantage of it. Join us for this amazing event. Um, and you are going to have a lot of fun. You do not want to miss out 10 amazing classes. You get access to it forever. Um, giveaways and so much more that we cannot wait for you to be able to go ahead and grab and attend. So cannot wait to see you all there. We are really, really, really excited to host you guys for the spring summit. It's going to be a lot of fun. We can't wait to get crafty. It'll um, be here before we know it. For sure. Like it's going to be here soon. Yeah. It's yeah. like less than a month away. Um, so we're getting really pumped up for you guys. Um, so we'll have supply lists and whatnot. So um, we cannot wait to be sending those out as well. So thank you guys so much for hanging out with us on this amazing Wednesday. I cannot wait to see you all um, back here tomorrow um, for another great live stream. And thank you guys so much for being uh, amazing. I'll actually be seeing you guys tomorrow. Tan Tan is whipping out. Oh, I would still go host the live stream, but Rachel just... You were still going to host tomorrow at 1.30? I uh, was go bump it up, but oh. Rachel wants to craft with you guys, oh. so you all have a great time. Or Tanner just doesn't tell me uh, anything. I never told you I needed you to host, Rachel. You just That's assumed true. I was just going to leave you hanging. Well, the calendar says you're gone. <laughs> Does it? Yeah. I, that's probably just my mental note, not to like make other not to make appointments and stuff i don't know maybe we'll maybe fine maybe you'll see tanner maybe you'll see me maybe we'll, we'll leave you guys both. who knows <laughs> we'll Whatever. leave you guys we'll, we'll leave you guys just just mingling just figure it to wait to figure it out um so the live maybe at a different time more you never know um but yes thank you guys so much for hanging out with us today hope you guys had a amazing project um amazing time making this project and i cannot wait to see you guys make your very own version of this one because it's gonna be a lot of fun so thank you guys and we'll see you back here tomorrow bye friends